Hey folks, this is Dico Herent and welcome back to RimWorld. So, I worked on a couple things between episodes here. I'm building up our north entrance, we'll just go ahead and do that. Um, I don't know, putting in a little more of a mud moat. I like this quite a bit, this is 25% work speed. Of course you can't put it on top of rock, but that's okay. I am going to build a refinery because it's going to take too long to work my way through deep drilling. So I'm just going to hollow this little area out and put it here, I guess. It's kind of a weird place to put it, but then I already have my machining table over my smithy over here. Maybe that's a dumb idea. Well, it's too late. I've already flagged it. So we're going to do that. I did switch my research to start on deep drilling. Irritatingly, how you get deep drilling before you get the ground penetrating scanner. But whatever. So we'll get that going. I just want to be able to mine chem fuel so that I can make more explosives. I don't mind using a little bit of wood and turning it into chem fuel, but I really don't want to get carried away with that. And we don't have any boom lobes to tape. Tame, uh, which is unfortunate. We do have a lot of bugs over here, and I had the most wonderful suggestion sent to me. What would happen if we got a caravan or something that came in from the east side of our map? Would they show up here in the bug tunnel? I don't know. So what would happen if I took the colonists that I hated, for example, and I sent them out in a caravan and then made them come back in in the middle of the bug tunnel? <gasps> I don't know. We'll have to find out. I don't have anyone that I hate enough right now. So we'll have to see. Um, I shuffled work priorities just a little bit. I'd forgotten the quality builder um, only lets your highest quality crafter build things that have a quality level associated with them. And since I had Chaco on there, he was doing that instead. And that's not really what I want. So I took him off constructing, which is kind of weird. I think Vulture then is going to do, let's see, 12. 30, yep, so he's going to do the stuff that actually requires, you know, like constructing ability. It does make Chaco a little less useful. You know what, maybe I'll turn it back on him for a while. And then I'll turn it back off later. Yeah, we'll just do that. So just remind me about that next time. I know it's crazy. I built end tables. What's even going on here? You know what? You know what? Let me tell you what. Screw you guys. I'm doing this right. I'm putting in a tool cabinet. Ha! What do you think about that? Now what are you going to do? There's tool cabinets everywhere. Actually, I don't want it there. It's a stupid place to put it. Um, I can fit in only one workbench here, actually. So let's just put it here. Then we'll put a workbench in front of it, because of course we will. Alright, good deal. So, the glitter tech stuff. So I went and popped open the mod and took a look at the recipes. So everything requires you have titanium before you can even build the benches that let you make titanium. So this is... Not great, I don't think. So... I don't know, we'll figure it out. Oh, that's right, um, and I changed these bills here. I said, you know what, why don't we just make some fine meals? And then I just realized that they need to eat all these simple meals first, because I don't want 41 simple meals clogging up my area. So we're going to go ahead and we're going to switch over to fine meals. Won't that be nice? And yes, I could have put in the other flooring that's much quicker to build, but I forgot. And now I can't change it, because I've already got all this done. It would be terrible. Still love to know why this game pauses like this, but beyond that... Okay, there we go. Mind you, we don't need this table. Oh yeah, and I made the wrong bill. I made a prosthetic leg, because of course I did, instead of an arm. So let's make an arm, so then we can actually make a bionic arm. So now we've got a prosthetic leg in a storage box. Butto still has not joined us. An increasingly poor decision on his part. Let's see here. Ah, good, yep, you guys are getting that built. I'll just build the outline of it right now, and that'll be fine. And then we'll have them finish digging this soon-to-be bug tunnel. We'll have to get this steel out of here because I don't want to waste steel. But then, yeah, put incendiary bombs in there and everything. Oh, it's going to be fun. I don't know exactly what we're going to do, but it's going to be awesome. Wind turbine broke down, that's fine. I put another trade beacon over here. I don't know. Things that I probably should be doing but don't think about. So, you know, you know how that goes. Yeah, beyond that, things are looking pretty good. Research is not going to take long, given that we have a level 20 researcher now. 19. Oh, going to be level 20 in just a second here. We can watch that happen while we talk about something else. We'll put the refinery in. I'd just like to be able to throw up some mortars quick. I could put up some storage shelves too, which is not a bad idea. I tend to not use those because I forget about them. Where would we put mortars? Probably up here, actually. Let's just throw a couple in while I'm thinking about it. Um, yeah, mortar, uh -huh. If we put them here, then I can put, yeah, I can put some storage in right next to it. Let's put two here. I'll just take this wall down. We don't need that, but, well, we'll just leave it. It doesn't matter. Let's see here. We are watching you click up to 20, right? 
That'll be fine. I'll keep a couple of each kind of shells around and we'll blow things up. It'll be fun. We'll have a good time. They're, of course, wandering through the wrong doorways because they just do. I honestly don't know why. Malice? Maybe? I guess? Alright, refinery. Let's see here. Refinery, here you are. Yeah, we'll just put it here, and then we can kind of extend our stockpile zone that's for wood only. Because, sure. Does that have a roof over here? It should. I mean, it doesn't matter, but I think it should. Volcanic eruption. Alright. That's mildly annoying, but we have more food than we know what to do with. Okay, how are you guys doing? Got the roofing up. Very good. Now, is this part of the home zone? Are you guys going to keep it clean? No. Here we go. Keep it clean. I'm not going to home zone this area yet. At the very least, having two entrances is going to make me diversify my defenses a little. So it should add a little bit of variety. I guess. Maybe. <gasps> I used up all our granite. Well, I'll be. I never thought I'd see the day. Exhaustion. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You'll be fine. Just deal with it. Here, let's take down some of this walls, but not all of it. So it doesn't collapse. Or more to the point, so it doesn't collapse on us. I don't care if it collapses on other people. There. Get that done. It's Dora, right? I don't know why you don't sleep. Like, this whole insomnia thing is really obnoxious. Prioritize sleep less to wake up sooner and get less rest from sleeping. It's like, well... I'm sorry to hear about that, but I'm not going to do anything about it. Okay, refinery. So, make hemp fuel from wood. Why don't you make... Oh, I don't know. A couple. Just do some to begin with, then I'll have to flag some more trees. And I'm pretty sure someone's still got that job. How are our little trees growing? Not well, but they're growing a little. And this is marble up here. No, that's granite too. Okay, we can take that apart too while we're at it. Sure, why not? Alright, so you've got the mining done. So they're going to work on this down here now. So that's excellent. I guess you guys can just bring these rock chunks over. That's fine. An aurora. Oh, that's nice. Mind you, we can't see it through the volcanic dust, but still. That's nice. Alright. Yeah, um, one of you was contemplating I could use this as an incinerator. And I agree, that would be pretty funny. But I really like that I have these, like, foothills of mass graves going. Like, it's just... It's beautiful. I should put some more up here. And people will be like, wow, as they pause during their invasion. They have some nice, like, hardscaping around here. I wonder what that's all about. But it's full of corpses. So, it always is. So let's see if there's enough light to keep things growing, or if I have to flip that back on. It's 6 o'clock in the morning. I see our power generation's going fine, so... Yeah, it's just a little cold out. That's fine. We could... We could roof this area back in and turn it on for a while. Just so things in here keep growing. Yeah, let's just do that. That's no big deal. It only takes a few seconds. It doesn't use that much power. I mean, it does, but... Let's see here. And who do I want to do chem fuel? Oh, I should put chem fuel up here, too. Manufactured. Chem fuel. Who is not terribly useful that I could make you come craft? Um. Thunder. What are you up to? Nothing useful. Why don't you come make some chem fuel? Aren't you one crafting as number four? Or I guess you're not. Now you are. Good news. Come make chem fuel. Let's see, I had Chaco set on medicine so we could craft medicine, thanks for the reminder. But I don't need it, because I've got Chalice to do it, so I took him off medicine. That'll let him focus on other things. I guess I don't know what. Oh yeah, I moved my power cables around so it's not as horrible. So we can actually take out these extra ones, can't we? Yes, we can. I don't know why I'm cramming all of this production down here when I've got this nice big area, but... It's alright. I think it's because we needed bedrooms, or we will need bedrooms at some point, so I just wanted to get ahead of the game. So, there we go. I still have not seen... Biko do anything Mary. Visited by constituent, minus eight. Oh. Okay. Well. That's too bad. I'm sorry to hear that. Sick, tons of pain, organs, blah blah blah. I'll let you finish up this batch, and then I'll clear it. Then we'll have a little bit of chem fuel. That's better than nothing. Okay, thanks. 
So now we've got 140 chem fuel. That's not great, but it's something. And let's go ahead and let's build a shelf up here. Shelf. We'll make you out of granite, because I feel like that would make it harder to explode, even though that's not actually true. I just like the idea. Lots of major break risks. Well, deal with it. We needed that heart. Hearts are important, man. Now, did someone make that arm yet? No. Probably gonna have to force someone into it. Chaco's building something else. That's fine. I'll let him finish this shelf, and then I'll make him go do the arms. His arm? He doesn't even know that yet. That's gonna be a surprise. Won't he be excited? I hope. Maybe. Okay, um... Items? Mortar shells. Right. Critical. Perfect. Okay. Boy, that's gonna be annoying. I wonder if I should make Dora sleep longer? Make her go to bed earlier? Get up later? I mean, I know that she won't necessarily, but maybe I can force her into it. So she gets a little more rest. Like, don't get me wrong, I strongly identify with that. I very, very rarely sleep. Reconnect, there we go. So, yeah. Alright, looks like you guys have got this done already. Nicely done. Let's just put in some embrasures while we're at it. And we'll have to run some other stuff over here too, but we'll get to that. And we can go ahead and we can take this down. We'll take the roof out so it doesn't fall on us. Something like that. I meant to click remove roof area. What did I select? Okay, there we go. Good job. And I just take it down. I like using this little lava area to like... I don't know, use as part of my structure. Psychic drone. I was hoping that was a psychic ship. But, alas. We can only dream. Do you not have power over here? I've got power right there. Light up. Make my base look nice. Thank you. Um, what should we do? How much cloth do I have? 235. We could make a billiards table. Antisocial. Chalice, that's fine. A reading table. Oh, deep drilling. Good. All right. Learn how to make the scanner. Thank you. Let's make some of this stuff just to make the place look nice. And we can actually close this off into its own separate room then. So we've got a bookcase, a bookshelf, a book rack... Huh. Neat. We'll make those. Let's make... a marble billiards table. That'll be cool. And we'll put it... Does it really matter which side I put it on? No. Put it right there. That'll be nice. Come on. Yeah, that'll look good. Where are all the bad guys? Like, seriously, bad guys. Show up. Let's keep building traps and stuff to entice them here. And I see we're out of steel. That's fine. To entice them to come attack us because of all the cool things we have. And how much they would like to take it away from us. Okay, good. We got the bug trap mostly done. Let's get some more of this steel out. And you guys can just haul this up too. That's fine. Probably the dogs will take care of it. Roof. You know, I told you guys to take down that roof. If you'd paid a little more attention. I'm just saying. How are our bugs doing? I'm wondering how much our performance problems have to do with our bugs. So I want to get rid of them. I actually do. And I realized that I put aside... Um, the enhanced turrets. I'm thinking pretty seriously about just using something else. Okay. Oh, you guys have used up all the meals and I wasn't paying attention. Perfect. Go ahead and make fine meals. So they've probably been eating raw food, but that's okay. I don't mind. Biko, you're gonna go cook. Excellent. Treating our prisoner, who still has sensory mechanites. Ate kibble. <laughs> we fed you kibble. Whoops. <laughs> Sorry about that. Ah, I'm bad at this game. Alright. Switching to fine meals will not only provide us with that little bit of mood benefit, but it'll help us get rid of our food stuff faster, too. Yeah. Hey, Jonas, we'll stop feeding you kibble. 2.3. Wow. And we're feeding you kibble. Dora. 
buddy. Don't do that. Biko, buddy. Come cook. Dora, don't do that. Stand there a second. Renick, stand there for a second. Biko, cook. Why can't I get you to cook? Come cook. We're prioritizing something else, and I realize that. Are you coming to eat kibble? No, you're just coming to haul kibble. Okay. Just let him make these four meals quick. And then you can all have delicious meals. There we go. Have some meals. Alright, good. Very good. Ah, good. Chaco's making the table. Excellent. Turn our components back on, of course. Psychic run is ending. Good, good, good. How are things looking up here? Okay, you've got that taken down. Let's just put... Let's just put granite doors up here in all these places. And now that we've taken out some flooring, I can go ahead and I can put in... Security, some more mud moats, because I think these are hilarious. So what else could I do to improve our colony wealth? Hmm... Oh, I forgot about this. Um, just... There, whatever. Um, I'll just uninstall this, that's fine. Then I don't have to think about it. Major break risk, Biko. Yeah, I know, it's because you're in a terrible environment, right? Yeah. Oh, I'm sorry, I have you prioritizing, don't I? Sorry, my bad. Now you guys are going to be so happy. Eight fine meal, plus five, yay! And they've almost forgotten about that whole dead guy that we took his heart out of. Very good. I think we're going to work on this mining first. Just to get that done, and then we'll put some IEDs in here. Sad wander, fine. You'll be fine. You're sad wandering inside the base. Ooh, ooh. Poor, poor quality? Seriously? Deconstruct. Unacceptable. You are going to get better than a poor quality table. These guys deserve it. They deserve at least a normal quality pool table. Very disappointing. Alright, how are we doing? Has this kicked over? Yep, looks like it has. Excellent. We've actually used up all our steel. Looks like Philly's here to help us with that problem. Excellent, thank you. Thunder, are you... Taking this apart. Okay, perfect. Alright, let's build that again. Poor quality, honestly. Now it says we have not enough storage, but we actually do, so it's okay. Normal. Fine. We're not actually growing any cloth, are we? Oh no, we are. Okay. Except this little spot is out of the grow zone. Oh well. Alright. Neat. So, yeah. How about this stuff? Let's make some more guns, I guess. We need more steel first. How's this doing down here? Doing all right. It's kind of funny that we finally run out of steel. All right, we made the arm finally. Thanks. Or we made the simple prosthetic. Um, who was crafting these? I didn't see... Vulture buddy, where are you at? Yeah, I see thunder. Can you not build this? Oh, skill too low. Chaco, make your own bionic. Thank you. Excellent. I realize that there's steel up closer to my base, but I just want to get this bit done. Because we're going to fill this up with anti-bug material. Starvation, yeah, yeah, yeah. You're fine. Don't worry about it. Nobody's ever starved to death in one of my colonies. Now that I think about that, that's actually true. Nobody's ever starved to death in one of my colonies. Huh. I mean, mind you, we've turned to cannibalism every once in a while, but that's not really the same thing, is it? I don't think so. Exhaustion, yep. You should be used to that by now. Chuck, I want you to come work on this. 
Or you can immediately forget what you're doing and go do something else. Apparently I can't get you to do it. I don't need him to finish it, just prioritize it for a few minutes. Okay, I guess it doesn't matter. That's fine. Welcome back, Dora. Now you're wondering, are you going to eat a meal? There you go. Welcome back. Now you should have stuff to do. Thunder is the only one who doesn't fall through to something immediate like mining. But that's okay. Butto, how are you doing? Starving? Oh, that's right, because Dora's not feeding you. Right. Um. Maybe we should put someone else on high wardening. Let's put Chaco on high wardening quick. And then prompt him to go warden. A poison ship. All right. Perfect. All right. Neat. All right, cool. So, let's see here. Yeah, now your chances are going to be terrible, but that's okay. 17 social. Holy crap. Okay, so how should we do this? Mortars? Just snipers and running? I'm pretty bad at that. As we've determined in the past. I've got several choices. Ooh, an exotic goods trader. That's nice. Dora, where are you at? You're still sleeping. I'll let you sleep for a few minutes. Chaco, is there any chance you want to finish this stupid prosthetic that you started and then forgot about? Mm, let's use a combination of mortars and other things just to kind of keep things working. Kind of keep things going interestingly. So we've only got two shells. So let's make some shells. High explosive shell. Make X times. Just drop it on the floor. That's fine. And let's make 10. I don't think we have enough stuff for that. Oh yeah, we do have enough stuff for that. Yeah, let's do that. I'm not going to keep any chem fuel inside because I'm not suicidal. But we can make a couple. The nice thing about a poison ship is you can leave it for just a little bit while you get prepared. Ooh, you know what we could do? Oh, this is actually going to be great. We're going to be duck around these sight lines. Oh, this will be good for kiting. This will be great. Oh, yeah. This is going to be fun. This will work well. I'm confident. And we don't have any guns up here, which is not great. Maybe I should fix that before we get too carried away with building other things. Um, how would I want to do this? We can just do it like that. It's ugly, but functional. Power switch. Sure. Um, we can actually make, let's say, let's make two guns quick while I'm kind of waiting for you guys to make other stuff. We can just make just regular turrets. We'll just make two of them. Because reasons. There we go. Because the mechanoids are probably going to come in that way, so we'll have to be ready for that. It should be fine, but just in case it's not. Alright, come on guys, machine away. Hard snow. It's 50 out. How can it be hard snow? Okay, well, whatever. I guess I'll just trust that you guys know your business. Minor break risk, yep, yep, yep. So many shells we have made? Six. That's getting pretty good. That's not bad. Um, I can't unpause this. Come on. There we go. Hmm. Six is enough. We'll do that. So, let's get our snappers set up. So, where do we have our sniper rifles? I should set up a dedicated storage zone for them, but it's okay. So, who do I want to snipe? Probably... Biko, are you in good health? I can't remember who needed a leg. Okay, you're in good health. So, you'll come get one. And... Chaco, probably. Probably not, actually. Kurdish? You're in good health. Okay. I should just have you guys come get these while I'm thinking about it. Come get that. And Biko, come get that. And... Rinnick, were you the one that needed a leg? Yeah, you need a leg. So actually, we should make a bionic leg while I'm thinking about it. So we don't need you to come. Let's say Thunder. Yes, Thunder. Okay, three of you should be enough. Come grab a sniper rifle. One colony idle. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Tell you what, Philly. Keep mining away. It's a little more down there for you. All right, now this is looking better. Okay, good. All right, it'd be nice if someone to build those guns, but, you know, without that, that would be okay. Okay, come here. And... I can't remember who I had a carrot dish. Yep, and thunder. Perfect. So, let's have some... Let's pop it open with... Let's pop it open with some mortars. Let's do that. 
Let's set these to only use um, high explosive shells so I don't forget and accidentally use something dumb. I could have made some EMP shells, but that's okay. Uh, Chalice, you're crafting. That's fine. Who's not crafting and can actually do something scary? Vulture? Maybe? Oh yeah, let's shut this door behind you. I guess? Philly, come here. By the time she gets up here, we'll be all set. Let's set both of these to hold their fire. Let's get the three snipers up there. This is kind of a fun way to do this. Open up with mortars, have your snipers ready. This should be interesting. Uh, what's our radius? A little closer yet. But this little thing to duck around the corner is actually going to be kind of nice. Chunk of spacecraft where? Oh. Right there. Oh, okay. Convenient. By the way, everyone stay in the home zone. Animals, you too. Okay. Do we have the mortars manned? We do. Alright, what's our range look like? Almost there. A little closer up. Just hide behind that alpaca. I should tame an alpaca. Okay, let's just do it. Alright, so the two of these. Let's go ahead and hold fire. Set force target. And let's see how many rounds it takes them to actually hit it. Ready, steady, go. Hey, they hit it in the first try. Ooh, that's rather more mechanoids than last time. It's not bad, though. We're going to get one shot off, and then we're going to run away. And hope that no one gets one shot. Alright, get moving. Get moving. Oh, God. Get moving. And having some mortars up should mean that they will keep chasing us. And that would be nice. Whoa. Yeah, they're totally going to come in here. Okay. Um, maybe we should move a gun or two up. <laughs> uh, reinstall up here. Yes. Whoa. There we go. Everything's fine. See? Oh, they turn back around. Well, that's annoying. Okay. Well, we'll start playing our usual little game here. The game of who can get the mechanoids to kite all the way back to the base. It'd be nice if you guys would mortar them. I'm just saying. You get a shot off. Yeah, but you missed. Alright. Oh, there we go. Good hit. As I am not paying attention. If you guys could just connect, like, while they're on their way over, that would be really nice. Uh-oh. Ah. Uh. Okay. Just a big hole in your torso. It's fine. Ugh. Come on. You guys can do it. Come around the corners. Nobody's brought that turret over. Oh, God. Um... <laughs> Where's that turret plan? Oh, oh, outside a loud area. Right. This is not technically home zone yet. Yeah. Forgot about that. Okay. Well, you're at the closest still, so why don't you come move a turret over here? Yeah. No. You're going to lose track of us right there? Ugh. All right. We've only got two more shells, so unfortunately, we're not going to be able to get a bunch more done here unless they connect one more time. Come on, guys. You got this. Come on. Oh, if they'd hit it once, it would still forget about us. So that's kind of weird, but okay. And you missed the ship. And now we're out of shells. Alright. Well, crap. That's disappointing. Alright. Well, let's let these guys run around for a little bit. Okay, we'll let them sleep overnight. Okay, um, chalice, come treat. Bah. 
That's disappointing. Okay, yep, that's fine. We'll go ahead and clear your prioritized work, and clear your prioritized work. Thank you. Disappointing. Very disappointing. We actually got a good bit of damage in there, too. Well, 18%'s not great, but it's alright. Maybe another raid will show up quick. Alright, well, we'll let this stuff burn. See, what did I tell you? That all of our area is going to go away. We're going to grow these trees, and then they're all going to catch on fire, and we're not going to get any wood out of it anyway. It'd be nice if other people would get up and go work on that. Curtis, did you have a chance to get treated yet, or did I make you get out of bed? Nope, you're up. Okay, good. Gentle snow. Yeah. Oh, our trees are going to mostly survive. Well, cool. Mad animal. <gasps> Yay, that was funny. I didn't know they would attack mechanoids. Oh, that's cute. I like that a lot. Nice. Alright, well... Let's give people a few minutes to get some sleep, and then we're just going to go do it again. Because of course we are. Okay, so we built up a grand total of four shells. Okay, Biko's up. Biko, Thunder, Kurdish. Let's try something very similar. We only have enough stuff for four more shells, which is disappointing, but... We'll give it a try. Let's have... Vulture. Come Mana Mortar. Alright, off we go. Maybe we'll get a couple good shots on the ship, and then we won't have to deal with this anymore. Now, I could also send our squirrel off to attack, but... Argopods. Oh. These have just chunks in them? What? Do those cargo pads have stone chunks? Slate chunks? Okay, that's a little weird. Okay, and we've upset the mechanoids somehow. So let's back up. Did you hit it with a shell? <gasps> you hit it with a shell. Nice. Alright, let's back up. I don't know if they're going to follow us far enough, but we'll try. Whoa! Slow down. No, they're going to get bored. Urgh. It's surprisingly hard to engage mechanoids. It's really annoying having enemies that leash. Come on. We actually hit the centipede. That's pretty funny. A grizzly bear is pregnant. <gasps> Amazing! Did you just kill a boar? I think you might have. As the robots go, durr. Okay, they noticed that. Alright. Well, let's just keep doing this. No, nope, they forgot. I mean, I could shoot the ship. But, if they're just going to stand there, I may as well get some free hits in on them. Free hits right up until that point. They notice that one. Centipede's not in a good way. But I'm having a hard time hitting these scythers. Yeah. This healthy one's going to be a problem. This one's in pretty bad shape. Moving is very poor. Nice. Moving is poor. Alright. But it's that guy right there that's going to end up killing us. Okay. Quick. Shoot him before he changes his mind. Come on. Ah, oh, man. Alright. Let's keep working on him. We'll get him eventually. Whoa. Didn't like that, did ya? Well, we'll just keep playing this game. That's fine. Nice. Whoa. Okay, just a torso shot. Oh, you guys can still see him from over there. Well, don't do that. Okay, Biko, go ahead and go get healed. Alright, so this is looking much better. If we could get that guy knocked down a little more, everything would be fine. Because we can totally kite everything else without any trouble. But it's that one Scyther. Norbital Factory. Okay, we'll check on you in just a moment. The Volcanic Shack. Oh, the Ash settled already. That's nice. Okay, get that guy. Right there. Shoot him right in his stupid head. Or shoot off his invisible legs or something. Actually, do that. Oh my god, you guys. I had such hopes. Hopes and dreams. Dreams that you would shoot a scyther. Like one particular scyther. Like just one of them. That one right there that's causing me all that trouble. 
crap. Taking more hits from that Scyther than I'd prefer. Someone's gonna get killed. It is gonna happen. How much did that affect your movement? Uh, 98%. That's not so bad. Okay. Just wait here. It's just gonna come around the corner and then turn around again. I guess, I mean, I could expand our home zone and go get some more wood and make some more shells and... I don't know. Thunder, how are you doing? You got a little bit longer. No need to hurry and get you treated. Oh my god. Maybe I should just be shooting the ship. A farming goods trader. Where are you coming from? Um... Mm, I don't think they're going to see you. Yeah. Unfortunately. Maybe. Oh, that's the wrong Scyther. Shoot this Scyther. They're getting pretty close. They might. Oh, I think they're going to come through this way. I think these traders are going to take care of our problem. Looking promising. Come on, run towards the traders. You can do it. I've got to let Thunder go pretty quick, so I need you to shoot and get their attention. Actually doing a pretty good job hitting it. All things told, given that one of you's got a big hole in your chest. Okay, new plan. Thunder, go ahead and go back. Kurdish. Shoot at whatever you want, as long as you connect, but you got to do it fast. Keep doing it. All right. All right. Unrestrict. And then we can go ahead and we can go pick up their stuff later. All right, so in the meantime, who's around? Dora, you're asleep. Why don't you come call that orbital factory? Just curious what they have. Yeah, you guys are going to get ruined, unfortunately. Okay, what do we have here? Oh, we could use someone to try. I mean, let's get um, 75 more. That's fine. Oh, uh, let's see here. What do we not need? We don't need any goat hide. We don't need any raccoon leather. Is there anything else I really want from you guys? I don't think so. Thank you. All right, let's see how this plays out. And then if we're hurry, we could go rescue some of them. Did you guys knock down the healthy scyther? <gasps> you did. You have an incendiary launcher. Can you set mechanoids on fire? Doesn't look like it. It doesn't like it though, that's for sure. See if they'd focus a little more on this scyther. Ooh, it's missing a leg. Hey, let's just watch this play out, then I'll bring some snipers back and we'll take care of them. You guys are kicking some ass here. This is great. This is by far and away the easiest of all possible ways to deal with mechanoids. Just let other people show up and kill them for you. Now, I don't think we're going to be able to come rescue Pearson. Yeah, no, you died. I'm sorry. If anyone else collapses from blood loss, though... Oh, this is hilarious. Alright, well... Hot damn, come here. Uh, who else had my sniper rifle, not Biko? Thunder, how's your health? You have not been treated yet. Biko, you have. Let's see here. Chalice, what are you doing? Tending. Okay, good. That's so funny. And they're still shooting at him, but they kind of lost track of what they're doing. Like, you have a sniper rifle right there. Alright. Well, however you guys want to play this, I guess. You know, whatever. You do you. Easiest thing in the world. We got two centipedes up. We'll just shoot the poison ship part. That's much easier. Alright. Cool. Alright. Dora, let's unrestrict you for the moment. We're going to have you come trade. The bravest llama ever. Okay. Roosters? No. Chinchillas? No. Alpacas, huh? Eh, nah. Fine meals we want. We've got tons of meat. We want that. Um... No, I think we're good. Thank you. All right, let's get this taken care of. I don't really care who you shoot, as long as you shoot somebody. They are running out of food because I keep taking Biko away. And make him go, like, shoot at mechanoids. But it's okay. They'll be fine. There's kibble all over the place, right? There you go. Nicely done. Oh, I saw that thing moving. I thought it was another uh, Scyther. 
Come on, you guys got this. Going great. Whoa, looks like it's winding up to shoot there. Mini guns have a further range than it always seems to me. Three meals. Ugh. Wonder back. Let's see how brave my guys are feeling. Good, good, good. These things are both just almost toast. Just a shot or two. Come on, you guys got this. Nice. Nice, last one. It's missing its smell sensor. I find that deeply concerning that centipedes can smell. Like, that just worries me. Caravan request? Excellent. You guys want computer components. I don't have any. So, sorry. Alright, well that was a little slow. Sorry, but it was better than many of my processes here are. Let's see here, are you doing anything useful? Are you... You're going back. Vulture. Come here, this is going to be your job. Alright, let's get these shutdowns up here. And it doesn't look like anyone needs rescuing. Oh yeah, here we go. Perfect, perfect. Who's nearby? Dora. Rescue. Do you have anyone else downed? We'll get some faction rep. As long as they never think to ask why it is that they needed to be rescued in the first place. Like, who could have caused that problem? Oh. Could have been anybody. Who even knows? Alright, let's get rid of this ship. So, caravan request for computer components. For a chandelier. Even a legendary chandelier? Eh. I think I'm gonna pass on that. Thank you, though. I appreciate that it occurred to you... Or, I'm sorry. I appreciate that I was your first thought when it came to purchasing computer components. Here, just blast away at that. Thanks. Did we get anything from this one? Oh, we did. Nice. Alright, do we have anyone else we need to rescue? It doesn't look like it. Are any of you guys going to collapse? Oh, yep, look, another one. Yay, we're going to get such good rep from this. Chalice, you're tending. Hoover, come rescue. I wonder if we can get their stuff. I wouldn't mind having another incendiary launcher. I mean, I don't need it, but... I wouldn't mind having it. They're leaving. Alright. Let's check on the ship part up here super quick. Almost done. Ta-da! Alright. That went extremely well, I think. A little tedious, but no worse than any other time I've done this. So, alright. On that note, let's go ahead and let's take a break. Thanks for watching. See you next time.